Hey guys, this is Joey. I'm coming to you for the very first time from my dorm in Georgetown University, and I can't tell you the fun that I've had over the past two days that I've been here. I arrived on Friday morning, and it's now Sunday, and between Friday morning and Sunday, I feel like I've lived a month of my life. And I'm absolutely drained, tired, my feet hurt, and I'm always hungry because I never have time to eat. So, I wanted to just give you some of the details about new student orientation at Georgetown University and some tips if you're going to be going into college or just because some of the cool things that I've experienced and those tips are kind of interesting. But at Georgetown, be prepared to never stop moving because if there's not a party, the NSO new student orientation. If there's not a party that they have not put on, there's a party at a dorm, and if there's not a party, party at a dorm, there's a social here or there, or there's somewhere that you can visit, and it never ends. So I am right now utterly exhausted, and knowing that I have to go in 40 minutes to dinner with a group of people that I've been spending a, a, a few events with throughout Georgetown, and also knowing that I'm going to be missing a get-together that's going on on the fourth floor of this building. I'm on the eighth floor. Fantastic view of Georgetown from my window, which I'll show to you at some point. But for right now, I just wanted to let you know that to be successful during new student orientation at Georgetown, you need to do three things. You need to know how to say no and go back to your dorm and relax. You need to carry with you at all times a water bottle where you can get water because it gets hot. And I found myself becoming ridiculously parched when I don't have water. You need to be ready to meet new people. These are people that I'm gonna be spending the next four years of my life with. And I can tell that these days are formative in the type of relationship that we're gonna have. Another thing you'll notice is that I have my scarves back. Now, I haven't been wearing a scarf in every video because I've been in the South, and in the South, if it's not 110 degrees and 300% humidity, I'm being stared at because I'm wearing a scarf, so I just gave it up for the summer. I'm in Georgetown, it's kinda cool, and it's kind of cool to wear a scarf, so I'm going to be wearing my scarves more often. I've actually become somewhat well known because of my scarf collection as I've been visited by three of the female residents of my floor asking to see my scarf collection. This video is going to serve as an introduction to my life at Georgetown University and to end this video I wanted to tell you a quote to recount you a quote that I heard at a pep rally that served as the introduction to new student orientation. And this quote has really begun to embody what I see as Georgetown's core value. The quote was, in the face of adversity, do you. So while I'm at Georgetown, I'm going to do the best to be who I am, and I challenge all of you guys to be who you are. I will talk to all of you soon. Bye.